Hey kittens, Silver here with Furbo Fox, and today I have another mystery package from one of my best friends in the world, Stacy, who just always goes above and beyond, and I'm still bowled over that she sent me something else on top of everything that she's already sent me, but, um, but here we are, and I've got this mystery package, not a clue what could be inside, so, uh, Let's just uh, dig right in and see what we have. And I've got my handy dandy scissors here. Oop, there they are. So I'm gonna just try to do this very, very carefully. The bag is definitely very squishy, so that can only be one thing. All right, let me just snip, snip. See if I can just rip it open with my fingers or not. Okay, let's see. Well, it's well packaged, whatever it is. All right, I'm probably gonna have to put this down to do this because it looks like we have a package within a package. So let me just prop this up for a second and see if I can do it this way. Okay, so that's one package down. They double bagged this, this bad boy, it looks like. So let's see. One more to go. Okay, here we go. What could this be? Ooh, I see a very pretty color. Ooh, what is this? Oh, look at the oh my gosh wait a minute let me see here is this a fluffy kitty is this a fluffy ginger kitty oh my gosh wait a second open up bag stop preventing me let me see here oh my gosh wait a second wait a second wait a second Guy, wait a second. Oh, I'm not even on. I'm not even properly focused right now. Oh my goodness! Look at this fluff. Oh, it's so so beautiful. I remember seeing this one on eBay and being really drawn because the colors are so much like Spice, that Douglas cat that I've been looking for forever. Oh my goodness! It's so beautiful. Oh, look at the eyes. Look how pretty the blue eyes. Oh my goodness. Oh, and he's, or, or she is so, so soft. The floppiness, the floppiness is just beyond, oh, beyond imagination. It's, oh, it's so cute. And the coloring is so, so beautiful. This was like exactly the type of coloring that I was looking for in a cat. And it's long hair too. Oh my god, it's so perfect. Thank you so much, Stacy. I can't believe. I just I'm I'm just in shock. Look at that face. I'm I'm gonna give her a little bit of a wash. Um and um and a nice um a nice brush so that uh you know, she's looking her best, but oh my god, she's so beautiful. Oh my gosh, wait till I have her all spiffed up. She is going to be just the belle of the ball. <laughs> she's, oh my gosh, I love her so much. Look how floppy she is. She's like so understuffed. She's going to be the perfect little squish critter. Oh my goodness. And wait, like we have a tag here too. Hold on, let me see. That's probably... Oh, I can't find it. Buried under the fur. So she's got, that must be her Yomiko tag. And Tush tag. So furry. Oh my gosh. This is, this was just so sweet and thoughtful. Oh, look, she even still has um her hang tag as well. Oh my goodness. Yeah, so I'm just going to wipe up her little nosy area. 
but oh my gosh, she's still so soft. I just love the coloring too. It's so unique. You, you don't see cats like this um, nowadays. Oh man, I wonder when she was um, when she was manufactured too. If like she's a vintage. Let's see. It's by Russ as well. I don't know. Either way, this is an amazing, amazing gift. Thank you so, so much, Stacy. Once again, you just, you just completely blow me away. Um, I don't even know what to say. I'm just, I'm so grateful. This is, <laughs> she's exactly what I was looking for in a kitty cat. Um, and she's going to get so much love and attention. Um, oh my gosh, she's probably like the floppiest cat I own. Probably even more so than like Sun Lemon. She doesn't have beans either, which, which I actually really like because it makes her extra squishy and easier to hug. Oh my goodness. Your little claws. Oh, thank you so much, Stacy. I absolutely love her and I'm so, so grateful to you once again. Um, this is really just, it's, it's beyond. <laughs> You're just the best. Thank you so much. And thank you everyone for watching. And I will see you at the next plush unboxing. Alrighty. Take care, everybody. Bye-bye. Hey, guys. So I just wanted to extend this video a little bit just to show you um, my Yomiko Classics kitten now that she's been fully washed and no more smudges on her face so you can see just how beautiful she really is. Um, and as you can see, there's a little bit of airbrushing. It's not, um, you know, it's not any kind of dirt or debris or anything like that. That's, um, those are the airbrushed marks. Um, and they actually have some of them, uh, some of the markings have a slightly almost um, yellowish tinge, which goes really, really well with uh, the orange color of her fur. Um, they complement each other really nicely. And you can see here there's also some airbrush marks um, on the outside rim of her ear. She's got the, the white ears and this really gorgeous um, orange, like sort of, it's a white fur with orange tips, I guess you would say. It looks really cool to, when you kind of stroke it and you can kind of see the different, um, just the, the way the different fibers separate. And those beautiful blue eyes. And you can see the airbrush detail around those as well. And the plastic whiskers. And her nose also has a, sort of like a gold overlay to it. She's got a little pink thread mouth. And uh, as I mentioned before, she's very much um, understuffed, um, super floppy. She almost feels like she doesn't have any stuffing at all. She's just, you know, she's just sort of pure squishy goodness. And she's also got the little, um, some thread on her feet for her claws, which are so cute. And I think I showed you the tag already. Yeah, the, the uh, hang tag I ended up just clipping um, and saving and putting aside. Just, um, yeah, I'm, I'm sort of, I'm always of two minds with, with tags. Like, I, I try to keep them on, but for this particular little cutie, I just, I, I'm, I know I'm never going to give her away. So, um, so yeah, just for, for ease of hugging and, you know, so it doesn't interfere with snuggle time. I figured I'd just uh, save the tag and just make her all fluff. And again, here's her. I think I held it upside down last time, but it's just too fluffy. <laughs> but yeah, so I'm going to need a good name for her. I think I'm thinking something sort of bright and sunshiny just because she's um, so vibrant. Um, the coloring is just is so is so gorgeous. Um, it just kind of makes you happy just looking at it. Um, so once again, thank you, Stacy, and thanks to everybody for watching. Um, I hope you enjoyed seeing my latest kitten, and I will see you next time.
Bye, guys.